Welcome back, guys. Today we are starting Medieval Dynasty Episode 2. I don't really have a plan for what I'm going to do because I don't really know what needs to be done, what comes next. Uh, I did play a little while off stream and kind of did a little grinding, um, harvested hundreds of berries and sold them to the village next to us. <clears throat> try to make some uh, coins so we got a little gold and I did you know some harvesting of meat um, what I did find out is a season in the game there's four seasons and uh, each season lasts only three days uh, so it's pretty quick so um, pretty much it was fall or autumn as it's called on here so I spent all of autumn where we left off um, just harvesting berries since they're ripe now and selling them. It's a good way good way to make some cash because there's berries everywhere. Um, so I spent a whole day, like a day and a half, gathering these berries and selling them to the lady in this village. And then I went out and just hunted a bunch of deer, wolf, fox. Got us some meat reserves. So I think I have enough meat to get me through the winter. Uh, some vegetables and so I still have a couple hundred berries left I don't know if they're gonna go bad or anything but hopefully we have enough food to last us through the winter I don't know how sparse food will be during the winter but we have that hopefully I'm sure we can buy food from the village if we need it uh, since we have a a nice little gold reserve now um, so let's go ahead and get started but before we do guys don't forget to like and subscribe if you're new to the channel subscribe if you're continuing watching and returning to my channel thank you um, and the dogs are barking in the background awesome <clears throat> let's see here so we're gonna I think it's not time now so as soon as we go to sleep and wake up, it should be winter time. Um, judging by this little icon up here above my compass, I think green means summer, yellow is fall, and we are at the end of fall. So let's go ahead and sleep and see what we wake up to. Winter is coming. And I don't know. Okay, maybe. Okay, so it's fall now. Okay, so we still have three more days before winter, so that's awesome. I don't know how things are going to change in the fall. It's uh, less green. So, wow, that's... Uh, okay, so I guess spring is bright green, summer is yellow, and fall is brown. So who knows what winter will be. Okay, so that gives us more time. Now we just have all these food reserves. Um... And what I did notice also is certain things are available at different times of the year. Like if you if you harvest berries in the spring, they're not ripe. So you have to wait till summer to have edible um, berries. So I don't I don't really see anything different growing. Um, yeah, so it's a lot of more leaves on the ground, so that's cool. That's cool how the whole terrain changes. The foliage, the pathways have changed. They're not just dried up dirt. They're kind of looking, starting to look cold. That's neat. It's never too early for gaming. Uh, gaming is life. So, that's that. So we have three three days. Three more days. So we got a different mushroom now. What's this? Parasol mushroom. That's neat. It's something new. Let's see if we can get some more of those. Oh, sticks. We got plenty of sticks. Okay, so I'm stuck on this quest of Al Alwyn's Story Part 2. Um... But we have to wait till next summer to finish that quest or to do the next part of it. 
whichever that may be. Let's see what do we have over here? Some rocks. Yeah, I think we mushroom, a red mushroom, red pine mushroom. So there's so far we've encountered three different types of mushrooms. That's cool. I don't know. I mean, <clears throat> I've never heard of this mushroom, um, but I have heard of the parasol mushroom and the other mushroom, the moral. I know that is edible because it's edible in real life. Yeah, he told me that uh, it was pretty cool, but and I mean, I'm liking it. The only thing you really have to worry about that I've noticed so far is uh, wolves and some of the animals that you hunt may attack you. Like uh, the bucks. The bucks might, might attack you, but I've encountered a few that didn't. Here's, it's a whole different, that's a whole different looking mushroom. I don't want to stick. Bitter bolete. Well, that's neat. So it's four types of mushrooms. And I would assume that fall is a good time to gather mushrooms because everything starts decaying and mushrooms are a fungus. Just walking around seeing what all has changed. Uh, red pine. We're going to get all these mushrooms. I love mushrooms. Probably could sell them to the village too. They might, since they're in season, they might um, bring forth a bit of gold. Whoa. Hey, guy. Whoa. Do I not even have any spears? I don't even have any spears. What is this? Okay, leave me alone. Why are we trying to build? I can't. Oh, we have too much weight on us. We can't even run. I'm fixing to die. We gotta drop something. I guess it's Paul's right now. I don't even have a. I do have a spear. It's just not in where it should be. Okay. I know I did. Okay. You don't want these problems, bro. Dang, he did some damage on me. <laughs> I totally wasn't even expecting that. Looking for mushrooms. Okay, we are encumbered. We need to drop off. Oh, the house is all the way back over there. Ooh, what is this? It's another mushroom. The fly ageric. So I happen to know a little bit about the fly ageric mushroom. In real life, it's also known as the Amanita muscaria. And it is an hallucinogen. You will trip and speak to almighty beings. Afterwards, you'll be sick as a dog. And it, in some cases, it can be fatal. Very fatal if eaten. Okay, so we have to... I don't know if I have any health on me. I don't even have any storage for all this crap. I got too much food on me. I don't. I need to make a food storage. Um, that's probably what I'll do now instead of collecting stuff to sell. I think we have enough gold. We don't even need it yet. We're not really making any purchases or paying taxes yet. I did find out that we will have to pay taxes as soon as we start building other buildings and we complete the farming chapter. Not really looking forward to paying taxes. Games are supposed to be my break from paying taxes, but, you know, what are you going to do? We live, we pay taxes, we die. 
Okay, so let's just get in this door slowly. Okay, so I think I... Okay, I need these. I don't even know. I can... I can carry them, but I can't move. Okay, so we need to get our HP up, and the only thing that I have discovered that will get your HP up is the broadleaf plantain. And if you don't know what the broadleaf plantain is, it grows in your backyard. It is completely edible 100%. See, not only do we get to play survival games, I can teach you about survival as well. Okay, I don't know how much more this will hold. Okay, so not much at all. We need another storage, so we need to make a food storage. Sto storage. A food storage we have a lot of food on us I don't know we can only carry 35 kilograms and we are two pounds over is there anything we can craft we no since we can't just craft a chest to put anywhere it's the only thing I don't like about it we have to build a whole building and to do that I'll have to carry eight logs well I can't carry eight logs because I'm already encumbered uh, do I have maybe just maybe I don't think I have eight logs I have one log okay so we need to figure something out okay we got the moral mushroom we can't we don't have any other moral mushrooms to put in here uh, we're carrying 10 pounds of berries. We got a wood hammer that's about to break. Okay, so let's, let's. Okay, so we need hydration. I guess we can just eat all these berries. This might take a second. It's going to hydrate us and fill up our hunger. I need that extra room. And I don't really want to carry one log at a time. So the berry gives you half a point of food and one full point of water. It's kind of crazy that the meat only gives you like six, six points of uh, hunger. You have to eat a lot in this game, but I, I didn't want to go that far. I did. Okay. So I did have a few talent points to spend on skills and I, which one was it? Survivalist. I did go ahead and learn that one. Um, because you get 10% slower loss of food and water and the next level will get 20% slower loss of food and water so that will be awesome uh let's see what else did we get i got the survival knowledge and survival sense survival sense will let you sense mushrooms feathers and herbs in inspector mode so once you go into inspector mode you can actually see where the mushrooms feathers and herbs are in your surrounding area that's pretty cool it's, it's kind of it's it's a real good one to have. Um, we are still encumbered, uh, but also, like you can see, all the herbs and stuff you can pick. But look at your stamina. Being in inspector mode drains your stamina so quick. So maybe we'll be able to level that up somehow. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and chop some trees. Maybe I'll build the food storage over here. <clears throat> I kind of would like to extend up into the forest of my village instead of going along the river, but I'm just going to keep it. More mushrooms. I don't think we need any more of that right now. If I can get eight logs in one area, maybe I can pick them up and not have to move. And so there's four. 
Is that a fly, a generic? No. Oh, there's another one. So it's five different types of mushrooms. Or where are we at? Five, six? Of course you're going to follow the opposite way. Maybe. Okay, so can we pick up all of these without having to move? Or move far? Okay. Okay, we're still doing pretty good on the weight. <clears throat> wow, those berries. They weighed a lot. Okay, we can still move a little bit. Okay. How many is that? Seven. Okay, we need one more log. Oh. It's right here. I don't really want... Alright, Hoss. I'm going to need you to creep it. Let's go ahead and pull up our crafting. Buildings. Storage. Food storage. Okay. That's the front. What is the rotate? It doesn't really... I can't really tell on my screen. It just looks like two little... Two little squares with cracks in it. Uh, it's not R. Uh, let's try... Can we even rotate? Swing holster torch. Oh, wait. Okay, I see. It's a comma and a period. We're going to have to change that. Uh, let's see. Actually, I want to put it close to this road here. I think... I don't know if we're going to need the, to be close to the river, honestly. I feel like if <clears throat> we are to keep cutting trees and building, we need to advance, you know, south. Go into the woods so we're closer to the, to the wood and just kind of keep moving forward just like humans do. We move to an area, we consume the natural resources, and then we spread and consume more resources. Or do I need to stay close to the water? Am I going to need it for irrigation? You know, there's so much of this game that I do not know anything about. And I'm trying not to watch videos or play too far ahead because I want to learn with you guys who don't know. I'm, I'm sure there's lots of you out there who already know everything. So this looks like a good spot for the food storage close to the... Let's not put it so close. Right here. Okay, that looks good. I like that. Nice. So... My shack, food storage. Oh, la, 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 la. okay. We need straw and more logs. Okay, so let's cut some more logs. Can I chop them up before it hits the ground? God, it's tired already. Lazy bum. Okay, we got the logs. Alright, let's go throw these on there. We're just going to leave it as it is. We're not going to worry about switching. We're just going to leave it with the water wall. Because it, it kind of looks cool. It's, it's like a... A wood weave. You know, we upgraded ours to start with. We didn't keep it basic. We just went straight into upgrading. Okay, so we got... Lord, we got to make another hammer. And equip it. Two, four. Okay. Use up all the sticks. Go get some more logs and sticks. I may need to go check on that. Uh, 
pick it up pick it up okay shop another tree shop another tree pick up a stick oh thought we'd knock it down already I want to let a tree fall on me I don't think it's going to do any damage I need all the sticks as well. Okay. Carry this load over here. Pull out a... Tr Ooh. I feel like I'm going to need these for a good time later. And spin the sticks here. It's moving along pretty quick. Okay. So we need more sticks. More sticks. More sticks. Pick it up, man. Quit playing. The quicker you get done, the quicker you can take a break. I want to get those mushrooms. What are they? Oh, okay, we've already got some of those. Okay, chop another tree. Cha! Cha! All right, that did it. Oh, where'd we go? Probably gonna need a bunch of straw for the roof. It's probably a thatch roof. Oh, wait, let me pull out my hand. Let's finish up the walls first. Boom. Order, order in the court. Boom. Okay. Awesome. Walls are done. Now the roof, we need straw. We're going to need a bunch of straw and one log. Boom. Okay. So more logs and straw. Let's go gather a bunch of straw. Oh, man. We have plenty of straw down here. What are you doing? Put that up. We don't need all that. What a time to be alive when you can go out, cut your grass with your hands, and put it on your roof. Where I live, our grass doesn't even grow. I think it probably got cut one time all summer, and it's, I mean, it just doesn't grow. Too many trees. fall have you okay well just oh there they are okay maybe we can carry one more we need to go get a sip of water we're thirsty okay so now we have a place to store all this food and I don't have to carry it on my person we have plenty of th okay we're gonna be able to finish it off Maybe, oh wait, maybe not, because we have this wall here. Yeah, we're going to need some more logs. Okay, let's go ahead and throw up this bleh, straw. And then we'll have to come back with the logs and finish it off. And is there a wall? Okay, yeah. I know some of the buildings are open, like they don't have some walls and... 
roof or yeah some of the roofs hit that tree man and we are tired don't stop just because you're tired we'll keep going oh bird feathers we we'll probably need those for arrows so we'll hold on to them they can't weigh too much Give me that stick. Give me that stick. Give me that mushroom too while I'm here. It's just hard to pass up just picking stuff up off the ground. Oh, so there's... Dang, I was thinking it'd be a whole one section. Dang. That sucks. We may finish it before dark. What up? Um, we're stuck. Forward, back, left, right. We can't, we can't move. And we're not encumbered either, so. What if I, okay, hang on, hang on. There's a way to do this. Can I just pull out? I think we can, yeah, I think, yeah, that, okay, now we can move, okay, cool. He's so tired that he just couldn't move anymore. There's still a small section up there. Like, how do I get that? Oh, and maybe it stays open. It's just green from the other side. Okay, that's done. Bam. Bam. Oh, God. Dog, what's up? All these logs. All these logs. Let's take this tree here. I need to go cook that boar meat. I have yet to see meat spoil, but I really don't keep up with the count. Maybe it doesn't just give you a piece of rotted meat in your inventory. Maybe it just disappears from your good meat. So I guess we need to pay attention. And my axe broke. Do I have what it takes to craft another one? Of course not. I got the sticks. I just need two rocks. Um, rocks are... Okay, so we can, there's, oh, how convenient. I was, I was just about to say that rocks are kind of difficult to find. But there's that. Let's go ahead and equip. Okay, it, that automatically equipped. Sometimes it does not. Probably gonna need one more trip. All the logs, four logs. Then maybe I'll be able to carry more. <clears throat> I get all this food dropped off. Hopefully, I can store all my food in there. I don't know what the storage is gonna be like. Come on, man. The, it's time to get it done. Dang. It took you all day to build this house. Okay. Four logs. Can we walk? Yes. It's not the trippy mushrooms. Oh, we got to build... Oh, there's more. More logs. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. We're just going to do what we need to do. 
Nobody said building your own town and village was going to be easy. There's no boar out here, is there? Okay, so... Oh, it's the feathers. I don't even think I've seen a bird. Just feathers. Pick it up. All I want to do is finish this and drop off some food so that I can carry more stuff. So another thing I was thinking, um, I need to figure out how to craft <clears throat> some better clothing because I don't know if this clothing is going to be suitable for the winter or not. Just trying to think ahead. Okay, so there's... Oh, okay, so that was it. Okay, chest. Let's see here. We're going to transfer all of these. They don't weigh much. I'm going to hold on to them. Because <clears throat> uh, those restore HP. I'll transfer these. Uh, uncooked meat. I'll hold on to those four and I will transfer at least 23. Uh, rotten bear. Okay, so f so things do rotten. The whole stack of them. Okay, there's a 100% chance to uh, get poisoned. So... That was the first that's the first thing since I've started playing that I've actually seen spoil. So we'll go ahead and put all these mushrooms in here. Um So we're up to nine eighty four in our coin. We uh we only had fifty. So we made nine hundred and thirty four gold selling people berries. I sold a couple axes, a couple spears, a couple hammers. But I feel like the berries is where it's at. Because it, it takes a little while to harvest. But uh, you get you harvest five at a time. And you sell one for one gold. So you sell 100 berries. It's 100 gold. Some expensive berries. Okay, so I don't know if we just can drop this. or Okay, so first, first though, I need to go back to... Where's my, where's my door? I need to go back to see if we have more food in here. I think we do. Okay, so we have... Okay, there's berries. Let's transfer all of those. Transfer. Transfer. Unripe berry. I don't... Okay, that reduces the level of poisoning, so we'll just leave that in here. This gives you half a point of food, but a 20% chance to poison, so it's not even worth uh, chancing. I wonder if we can drop this stuff on the ground. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take that out just to try and get rid of it. I'm not going to need it. And we are encumbered. Okay, so let's see if we could just clear out some things here. So, rotten berry, drop X. Okay, so let's drop all of those. Unripe berry, we'll drop all of those. Okay. While we are here, oh, they just <laughs> berries on the ground. While we are here, we're going to go ahead and cook these raw meat. Um, pull that back out and light the fire. Okay, so let's cook. How many do we have? Okay, so we got two more. Okay, all of our meat is cooked, and while we're at it, our hydration's looking a little low, so let's go ahead and fill that up. 
knock out some of these berries. I'm thinking we could kind of just work through the night doing things. Um, that way we can, because there's only three days in a season, so we're already through one day. Okay, so let's store berries. All of them. We'll hold on to those. All of them. Most of me will hold on to those. Okay, so. We really need to upgrade how much weight we can carry if it's even possible. 15% on the damage. Okay, so what's next? We, I mean, we're kind of caught up on the story right now because we gotta wait till summer. We have to make it through all the way through winter and spring just to finish Alwyn's story. I don't know how we can. Let's see, management journal probably. Okay, complete some quests for neighbors. So the quest that we're on now is going to be another quest for a neighbor. So we'll that will knock that out also. Uh, successful flirting for all that we get 50 dynasty reputation in our development status small farm okay talk to Sambor we could talk to we could journey to this guy find Sambor uh, we got a skill I didn't even know we had a skill Okay, so mule weight limit five kilograms more weight limit in inventory. So we got that. We got five percent faster logging. It really doesn't take that long. We're not mining or digging yet. Slower axe durability loss. I mean, I don't know. Five percent slower pickaxe shovel durability. We're no we'll need that. Ten percent bigger chance to find iron when mining. We're not mining yet. Uh, we're not excavating woodcutter's trance. Ten percent faster tree cutting for next ten seconds. Stacks up to one. I'm just gonna go with the mule. We can carry more weight. Uh, that sounds like a. Oh, can we not? We can't. Hmm. Maybe we need to tier one, tier two before we can tier three. Okay, so. Do we need to pick something from tier two? I mean, or should we just put it back on extraction knowledge? One more skill point from extraction activities. Okay, so we'll just do that then. Okay. Didn't even acknowledge that I spent the point. Um I really would have liked that mule. That would have been a nice. St okay, so let's see. Does it show Sambor? Okay, maybe he's up here or maybe not. So we have to talk to Sambor. I don't really see. Maybe it's in this village right here. Is that an exclamation point behind all that banner and people? Can't tell. Maybe he's up there. So maybe we need to go to Baranica. And then stop by and see what this question mark is. Probably a mission or quest. So let's go ahead and sleep. We'll go ahead and wrap this knot up. Alright. Everything looks good. Berries are still there. So let's take a little journey. All the way up here into Baranica. 
Oh, wait, wait. Before we head out, we have... We have one spear, so can we, do we have what it takes? Okay, we can craft another one. And we'll do a little hunting while we're out. Okay, so we have three. But when I just hit my five, it didn't take one out. So let's go ahead and put that one on six. So we got a spear on one, five, and six. What is our... We can't carry much. I'm not about to follow this path. I'm going to angle straight for it. Just run straight. Might be a bad idea. May encounter a dragon. I don't know. Um, I know the wolves, if you get too close, they'll howl. It's kind of like your warning. You know, back off. And if you don't, they will attack but oh there's some houses here um okay that's a whole village i think we i don't think i've been there maybe i've been there i think we went there in the first video maybe um but if you walk away when they start howling then they won't bother you they won't chase you down but those boars they will attack you So if we just stay, if we stay on this path, it'd take us straight there now. So we'll just, we'll just run with this path. We'll just run on the path. Right off. Some more berries. Oh, well, they're all picked up. What is it? Oh, okay. So we've seen the buffalo. I'm sure the buffalo will attack if you attack them. Maybe they're passive. Okay, yeah, I think we're good. I don't, I don't think he'll bother us unless we bother him. I say that, and then I get... Oh, yep, see? You know, that's. I just knew that was going to happen. We only... Dude, dude, throw it. Shit. What are you doing? What happened to your spear? Okay, I'm going to need those back. I have no more. Okay, we got one. Which slot did it go in, though? Did it go in one? Did it go in? Okay, five. Ooh. Dang, he almost killed us. One more hit and he would have killed us. Dead. Dead. Okay, so. That kind of got my heart rate up. I just knew I knew it was going to happen too. As soon as I turned my back on him. It'd be like that sometimes. And we lost two spears. See, the mess, the, the thing, another thing I don't like is I'd rather have a heads up display show me where my things are in my toolbar so if I have the spears assigned to three different locations because you can't stack them you have to have them you know if you want to have three spears on you you need to have them in three different locations so that when I pick one up well does it go which location you know which location does it go to because it didn't go to the first open location because one was the first one I pressed and it wasn't there. It was in five, so. That could, uh, a small little heads up display down here on the bottom. There's plenty of room for it. It's not gonna obstruct the vision any. We have missed the whole town. Where, where are we? It's not even showing me on the map. Maybe I'm behind the banner. 
somewhere, maybe. Okay, that's a roof that I'm looking at. That's not a hill, so. We made it. Now, Sambor. Sambor. Sambor? He's in here somewhere. Now, if we press... Oh, in here. If we press our left alt, it'll show... It'll, you know, spectator mode. Well, not really spectator. Okay, neither... The bro -wo yo yo the I'm not even gonna try to pronounce these names. You look just like the guy from the other village that I first talked to when I came. So hold on, he wants look, he wants me to help him with something. I'm not here to help anybody. I'm supposed to be looking for Sambor. Maybe he's the question mark. I don't really want to do anything for anybody right now because we still have this mission going right here and I don't want it to affect um, anything so let's let's figure out why I'm not on the map player it's not even showing player okay so let's keep walking hopefully not get attacked check the map see okay still not there We'll just have to find it the hard way. And it's not even a village. It might just be somebody standing in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. So we actually... I do need to find some more plantains. Uh, they may be out of season. I hope not, but I don't see any. I see mushrooms and that. Are, okay, so these are plantains right here. Those little, those little lookers right there. Where'd it go? Those are very good to have, but hard to see. They just blend right in. And they look just like the plantains that grow wild in your backyard. Like they, they nailed it. They didn't just make it look like something else. I guess we have to get the stick to get that one. Okay, so let's go ahead and top that off. Okay. Alright. I think we got turned around. I hope not. I don't know where we are. I can't tell. I might just have to save, close it out, and then come back. But we'll... Oh. Well, apparently... Let's see if we're on there now. We are not on here now, either. Um... I guess we just hit a... Oh, we are way up here. So we are out of... We are out of range, so we need to turn... And follow this straight through some marshlands. Wait, 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 what was it? I could have... Okay, so... There's something there. Somebody... Uh, maybe it's just a quest. Let's follow this little creek stream. I want to pull us a weapon out. I don't know which. I only have one. Uh, let's make another one real quick, or two at least. Okay, so. Give me two logs. Let's craft two. Two of them. Okay, so 
And then just craft two of them? Where is it at? Okay, so we'll put this one in one. Okay, there it is. Now it just uh, appeared. Okay, let's check the map. Get our bearings straight. The bearing straight. Okay, angle down a little bit. Pull out our spear. Let's, oh, there's a wolf, so let's walk around the wolf. I mean, I killed a wolf, and he didn't really attack me. He just kind of stood there and growled. He kind of walked towards me. He didn't rush me or anything, and I threw a spear, hit him in the head, and one-shot him, so they're not crazy. They're not maniacs. Okay, so we need to even up a little more here. I hope there's no alligators. <laughs> as soon as I say that one hits me in the back. Or a titanoboa. There is a boar. He wants... Ooh, headshots. Nice. That's a thing. Got us some more meat. Some more meat. We could use those tusks for something too, but I don't... He don't think the way I do. We could also use his bones. And then again, he doesn't think the way I do. Okay, so we are almost there. Should be a road right up here. And it's actually buildings. It's not just a guy standing in the middle of the... It might be just a solo house. We'll see. Yo, my guy. Are you Sambro? Sambor. Whatever your name. Yo. Yes, you are. Hey. I'm trying to talk to you, bro. I am. Lorden's nephew. I heard you have certain... Oh, okay, so these are about the wolves. We we never did that one. Dude, I can take wolves out like nobody's business. Okay, so... It, I wish I would put it over there. So we have a skill point again. Hunting knowledge. Steady hand, that might... Okay, so we'll just go with this one. That way we'll just level up just a little bit quicker. Plus one more skill point from hunting activity, so... Ugh. Then we'll work, uh, next we'll probably get the steady hand or something. I feel like I do okay. Let's check the journal. Uh, talk to you. Okay, so I need to go all the way back. So I came out here. Not to do anything, but to deliver a message. And now I got to... Is he looking? Can I take? He's got a bow. Okay, you know what? We're not gonna ruin our reputation. We're not gonna. We're not gonna rob him. Okay, so I just need to follow this path all the way back. Go talk to Uni Ghost. Dum -dum 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 -dum. Dum -dum 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 -dum. It's about time to sit and have some water and some meat. I think this is where, when you first start the game, I think this is where we stand in when we first start. Oh, so some of these 
have things in them. Yes, water skin. I've been wanting to craft one of those, but I don't. I can't. I don't have the ability. So somebody, somebody's cart went off road. I can only imagine they must have came through here walking at you know 50 miles per hour and just lost control of their cart. I would say the wheel broke, but I mean it's intact. They just, or maybe they were drunk. Maybe they shouldn't have been at the tavern at seven o'clock in the morning. I'm just saying. They had they they just went the fence. I mean that's that's a pretty strong fence. And he just took it out. So we need to find more carts because I feel like they're going to have things in them that we absolutely need or can use. So if we see any more of those, we'll, we'll be sure to check them out. The ones over there close to my camp, they, uh, they were just empty. I think we need to spin it's start it's gonna start getting dark soon but I think we need to spend like a day looking for those carts what I really need to do is uh, figure out oh that's mine I f forgot we got a whole new building now I need to figure out my um, my clothing because I don't think if I look I don't think that you know, these linen or cloth is going to keep me warm. I feel like we might need like a, a hood or, you know, some gloves or something. There's little leather shoes here. So, that's, that's our main focus is finding some uh, clothing for the winter time. Even though, see, I did think ahead. Um, when I was originally going to build my hut, you know, it, it came, you know, stock as a waddle and it said that the heat retention was not good in the waddle. So I opted for the wood. So maybe if I spend a lot of time inside with my fire going, it will keep me warm during the winter and I only have to come out to eat because I don't know what else we we'll be doing besides maybe a quest but maybe if I stay moving it'll keep me warm but we can still go check out the land because we haven't we haven't ventured around much I mean as far north as we we've been we just went you know I haven't even been up in those hills so we need to explore I haven't even been far this way at all. Just far enough to the little berry bushes out there. Okay, so I think he's in here. If I if I remember, no. They will tell on me. Okay, so maybe he's. Is there anything in this one? No. See. Okay. Is he in this this one? Okay. Kinda, no, he's not in this one. This is a whole different family. Harold, what's up, Shorty? Hey, you have things. You don't have things. You why well, you have a bag over you if you don't have wares? Where is Unighost? Herman Gilda. Um, oh, so we lost some approval just now. I don't want to just invite her to my settlement because I'm not ready to have people living in there. I have to take care of them. I want to tell you something, beautiful lady. No, because we just 
started talking. Okay, so I'm just gonna go for now. We'll holler at you later. Yo, what's up, Lubert? Lubert? Um, I don't want to invite him to my settlement. Same reason. Okay, so we moved up a couple points on him. Um, we can recruit him to come and help us work later. Uh, once I have... Where is Unighost? I mean, it's giving me the exclamation point here, but... Just, do I need to talk to Atmar? No, I don't want to help you with something. I'm on a mission. I have to find Unighost. He's not in there. That's a storage house. This, he's not in here. That's a goose house. A house of goose. Set. That's not him. He don't even have a thing on his head. He looks just like the guy from the other village. Unighost. Where is Unighost? Edberga. Where is Unighost? Maybe. You know. What? That's. He's sitting down right here. With no parcel over him. He's like. Okay. It's updated. Talk to Dagobert. I don't want to talk to people all the time. Okay, so let's pull up our map and see. I don't know. I don't know where this guy is. Who's that? I don't recall seeing him anywhere. Um, maybe he's one of these guys in this building that it was trying to lead me to, but I'm not ready. Um, Dago, yeah, because he had the crazy name with the. Uh, no, I don't know. Dago Bert, Dago Bert, Dago. It's saying. Love Bert. Maybe he's in another village. Honestly, I got an exclamation point up here. And it says maybe it's just a guy that needs help. Okay, so if he is in another village, maybe it's right here. I don't know. Um, but what I do know is I'm thirsty. I need a spot of water. Okay. Whew. Let's go ahead and eat a bit of meat. And we need to, we got 10 meat that we need to go cook, so. Let's head back to our little base over here. See, now he's got the little parcel on him. That's, that's, uh, Unigos, but it just wasn't registering on my compass. I need someone to come and work work the food storage for me. Um, like hunting. Stocking it with food. Now that I have a little bit of gold, I could pay some taxes. Um, and let's see. Oh, I think I have a field planted. Okay, so yeah, I have a field planted here. 
So what I'm going to, and it, I mean, it's perfect because that's going to be my food storage. So I have people work in these fields and I'm actually going to build some more here and stretch it out that way. And all this land over here can be uh, fields for crops and vegetables and wheats and grains, whatever you grow. Um, and then I'll probably, I might could put a couple houses here, some small, simple houses here. And maybe uh, some kind of storage here. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. But actually, before I can invite someone to come and help me, something in my eye, ah, come and help me work and work for me, um, I need to build another house for them to live in. I don't really want li people living with me because they have bad habits like breathing so we don't want people I wonder I know I need resources for all of them but house simple house simple small house so I could just build a simple small house and that'd be that'd be fine for a worker maybe so we just need some okay first while we're here walk inside let's cook this meat wait we, wait we want to do more than one no do the remainder okay so we'll cook that meat and then we'll go and see if we can get some logs and maybe start on another house I'm going to have to eat all that meat just to get my health back up. It says it drops 10% lower, but I really don't see it. Like, for real. It drops so fast. Okay, somewhere we picked up a fur hood and fur boots. Like, I have not seen that in here before, so I have no idea where that came from. Um, a water skin. I... Do I need to collect four of them before I get it, or let's try to, okay, so it's on eight. I don't know, maybe we can hold up to four of them. So to have a hundred water, you have to drink the whole thing. Four charges, okay, so that's what it is. Okay, so we need to try and fill that, figure that out. So now that we have fur boots and a fur hood, I kind of feel comfortable about the winter time. So we'll just keep that off until winter time. The weight is like, how can you have fur boots and a fur hood and not even weigh half a pound? That's amazing. Our leather weighs quite a bit, but we have 25 pieces of leather. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go over here. We're going to put up some of this stuff. Uh, the feathers, they don't weigh much. Fur. We're gonna transfer the transfer the fur. Transfer and the leather. So now <clears throat> we can carry a bit of weight. What else? What is heavy? The spears. Really, we're not. Okay, we'll we'll transfer the sticks. All the sticks. Okay, so. We can carry 20 pounds. So let's let's go get some logs and let's just build a small house. You know, just throw up the foundation at least. That way, <clears throat> when I'm ready to get some help, um, I think the first help, because I can cut trees down all day. There's nothing to it. I don't need help with the trees. I need help with the food. I want to have more food than I know what to do with. So if I have another person hunting or farming, you know, that's, we're going to need more trees than that. That's, that's a bonus because to have a civilization, you're going to need lots of food. I can build a house at a time, but 
me just out here hunting, it would take me all day of slaying animals just to feed people because, hell, one piece of meat doesn't do much. You need to eat ten at a time just to get anything off of it. Okay, so. We have that. We can go ahead and build a simple house. I'm going to build a little simple house right next to mine. This is going to be my right hand man. He's going to help me. Let's see. Let's, we can put him. Uh, we can't put him too far back. I don't want it to be even and look. You know, I don't want it to look. Uh, I kind of want it to look clean. I can't really tell where it even is. Uh, I mean, this is going to have to look good. Uh, that's pretty dang even right there. That's that's pretty good. So, um, we got two log. We got some sticks. We can do a little bit. Wait, what that build there? Okay, there's a door. I thought it was just a wall. Okay, so we need log. Let's go ahead and burn these sticks up. Okay, do we have any straw that we need to burn up? Oh, yes, we do. And my hammer broke. Sounded like he cracked his knuckles when his hammer broke. He hit the wall. Oh, now we don't have any sticks or logs. Okay, so... Let's just go ahead and sleep. We have one more night until winter. I'm not really trying to get anybody in here before a certain time. I'm just I'm trying to take my time playing the game right. We're just going through and we're learning. We are dirty. The little the little icon down there by my stats. The brown one. That's that means you're dirty. So maybe if you don't take a bath regularly. Regularly? Maybe it'll make you sick or poisoned or I don't know. Get the bubonic plague or something. Okay, so we need to go gather some sticks and a log, and we need to make a hammer. Uh, uh, get the sticks, and we're gonna need a lot of sticks for the house anyway. And then maybe when winter time's over, summertime comes around. We can recruit. We can get that guy to come over. Oh, there's a lot of sticks up here. It's like a whole tree fell. If we can just pick them up. That will be all right. Okay, so let's chop a tree down real quick. Pop. Pop. Okay. Get these sticks. We picked up a rock too. One of these logs is going to have to make me a hammer. Okay, we need to go ahead and get that crafting. Did it equip it? No, it did not. So let's go in here and equip that to four. Okay, so let's pull our axe back. Actually, let's get these sticks. I don't know. We're going to need a lot of sticks. We, I want to... I kind of want to keep some trees around the water because uh, it just looks nice. We could take this tree down. We might, we might grow here one day. Okay, we just unlocked the woodshed. Maybe that'd be a place where we craft more wood things, um, store wood, so I can. Probably get somebody to work that now. 
Okay, let's see. How much can we carry? Okay. We carry... Let's see if we can carry these. Slowly. We can carry them slowly. Roasted... Oh, roasted meat. Uh, for a second, I thought that said rotted meat. And I was going to be like, what? Okay. <clears throat> You know, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're already encumbered, but we still gonna pick up stuff on the way. Those houses are pretty even. I mean, you can kind of see, you know, just from their couple inches off, you know, but almost. Okay, so we want to do the walls first. That one just needs a log. This one needs log, some sticks, sticks, log, pow, All right, man, beat the hell out of it. Okay, so this is probably going to be one section. Oh, we don't have a log. We do have the sticks, though. Okay, so let's go ahead and place out all the sticks that we have. That's done. Just needs a log. It just needs a log. Oh. So it looks like we're just going to need a bunch of logs because we have plenty sticks. Okay. A few logs. <clears throat> Let's take a sip of water while we're here. A sip of water. Oh, and we need to figure out how to do this right here. Fill. Okay, that's easy. That's done. Is it full? Do I have to dip it four times since there's four charges? Let's look at it. Okay, no, it's 100% full. So you only got to dip it once and you get four drinks out of it. You get 100 water out of it. smart. I tried to chop the tree into the water and then it could float on down. Almost like I planned it. Okay, I think we can... I'm going to chop this tree down, you know. To heck with it. Okay, so we are midways through our third day of fall. So that means that when it's night and then we go to sleep and then we wake up, it'll be winter. Okay, so one more. Come on. Oh, we still got a little more room. We can carry some sticks. Okay. And then we'll wake up. It'll be winter time. We'll throw on our fur boots, the boots with the fur, and our fur hood. Boom. And if we want to recruit someone during the winter time, if we have nothing else going on for us, we could totally do that. Because now. He has a place to live. And the simple house is complete. Okay, and inside this simple house, I will also have another storage. So, I'm going to store these two leftover logs. We're going to transfer both of those in here. The rock. 
the stick. I don't know, mate. I don't know if using this is gonna make it mine, and then I just have like two houses. But we're gonna find out. Um, I got so much coin. I bet it. I bet it weighs on me. I'm just kidding. It doesn't weigh anything. It'd be crazy if a game forced you to spend your money because it was too heavy and it overburdened you. Um. So, it's midday. Last day. I don't know if we should... If we should try and craft something else. We can build a woodshed. A worker building for cutting down trees to obtain logs and sticks. Should be built in the forest. I mean, it makes sense. But my thing is, if you build a woodshed in the forest, well, when they clear all that area, then it's not in the forest. Unless, I don't know, maybe... Maybe my workers, they will um, just give me material, but they don't actually physically chop down trees, maybe. I don't know. Um, that'll be something we figure out, for sure. Okay, we don't have enough survival. Hunting lodge. Fishing hut. I would like a fishing hut. That would be fun. I'd like to do some fishing. Um... Also, we got a tavern. That'd be fun. That's what made my uncle rich. He had a tavern, and now I'm going to be following in his footsteps. Smithy. I want a smithy, too. I want a smithy. I can make iron. Iron tools, so... Okay, so let's just... Gather some stuff here. So we're just going to forage for a bit on this last day because there's gonna, not going to be any mushrooms in the winter time. So let's just go ahead and pick a bunch of mushrooms. Um, we're good on berries. They're just they're just spoiling. So These may too, but I think we can make soups with the mushrooms. Ooh, feathers. And um, the soups and stews that you make give you like 30 health points at a time. Instead of eating just one piece of meat for five health points, we can eat, you know, a bowl of stew for 30 health points. You know, it'd, be, it'd be much easier. But to do that, we're also going to need vegetables. So we got to get that. I mean, all these feathers. We got to get that going too. No. Pick them up. You don't need your torch out right now. Oh, I'll just use a few rocks. Like the rocks are kind of hard to find to me. Sometimes I just they, they're just hard to find. I'm just getting lucky right now because you guys are watching. So we're just we're just foraging, hanging out, vibing, talking, chilling, looking for goodies. Got some feathers. Sticks, bunch of stuff. Winter time's coming. I don't know. Um, I don't think I have to put wood into the fireplaces. So I don't think I'm gonna need like a, a pile of firewood anywhere. If I do, then I'll worry about that when it happens, when the time comes. Um, Okay, let's just take all this stuff back over here and drop it off and we'll go figure something out about what to do here. Whoa. Slingshot. I just want the mushrooms, bro. Gonna make some fire mushroom soup. 
Mushroom stew. I'm gonna go slaughter me a cattle. Tell me some T bones. Sauteed mushrooms. Man, that sounds good every time I see it. Okay, we got. He grabbed it so fast. Snatch that rock out the yard. Okay, so let's store these mushrooms. So we have mushrooms for the winter. That is that were shoes. That was not a mushroom. So let's go ahead and transfer all five of those. Transfer all twenty-one of those. Nice red pine mushroom. We'll transfer all those. Roasted meat. We'll hold on to that. St. John's water. We'll keep that. Okay, now we're going to go store these few little st sticks and stones. Sticks and stone. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We'll put it in this one. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll just put the, the sticks and stones. Um, what do we have time to do? I think we can I make wine with these? I bet once you have a tavern, I bet you can make um maybe wine with it. And your rye, you grow what rye. I, I did look at the stuff you can grow in the garden. So yeah, you'll probably be making beer with some wheat, some, maybe some barley, some hops. Hops. So I guess let's see how many spears do we have on this. We have three spears. We have. How do they keep getting taken out? Okay, so we got three spears. We could try to procure some more meat. We built our food storage. Now we just need food to put in there. Lots of food. All the meat. I probably... I don't know about the hunting over here, but I know... I know there's everything over here in the woods at my village oh i need to check my rabbit trap i haven't checked it in the whole stream i don't need to go to the bridge the water is not deep you don't have to swim you just walk across it plus we're thirsty ain't no fish in here oh i just broke my spear stabbing the water we got a skill. Can we get the mule now? No, we can't. Dang. We need to we need to do a tier two and then we'll try it. So we got force of nature, five percent slower axe, durability loss. Okay, let's do the axe because we actually use the axe. So Oh, we can't do that either. Maybe we need to complete a whole tier first. Wait, it's not. Oh, it's for survival. My fault. Okay, but see here, I went ahead and did tier two before I finished tier one, and I have a tier three. So I don't, I don't know. Uh, ten percent more health. That that is a good one. Stamina take 10% less damage okay so <sighs> oh 
Okay, so we're just going to do this one. That would be 20% slower loss of food and water. Okay, so we can do strong as an oak, which gives us 10% more health. So instead of having 100 health, we'll have 110. But if we lose food and water less, then, I mean, we're kind of strong as an oak anyway. So let's, um, let's do that. 20% less and then maybe by the third one it'd be 30% less so that'd be that'd be even great so let's go ahead and put on survivalist we already did or did we or did we put it somewhere else I hope not I don't know I don't pay attention much There's so much on the screen to focus on one thing okay let's get that stick we gotta go check the trap There's another trippy mushroom, Fly Ageric, also known as the scientific name Amanita muscaria. We do have a rabbit. So there is a. That was that was the first rabbit that that trap is caught. Maybe he was in there so long that he just jumped around and tore it up. Um, let's see if we can make another one because those really come in handy. Like. We need 10 sticks. We have one. Okay, so let's get 10 sticks. And then um, we'll build another rabbit trap. That's two, three, four. It's going to be real easy. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. Okay. We're just going to scoop up these piles of sticks over here and then and that rock. And we're going to leave that mushroom. We got we got enough mushrooms. We're not even going to eat them. We just got them for profiling purposes. So when somebody comes over and checks our food storage, they're like, dang. And you got it hooked up over here. You need a, you know, have to put a refrigerator in there. Okay, so I... Uh, I heard footprints. I'm just making sure that it's not another boar trying to charge me while I'm out here minding my own business. Okay, so. I mean, I'm sure that the traps, you know, for everybody catch rabbits and they catch rabbits quickly and effectively. But I'm just going to, I'm not going to move it. I'm going to keep it in the same spot because it is doing so well here that maybe if I move it somewhere else, it won't catch. I know. It makes sense for it to be in the woods. We're near berries, so the rabbits, it's a fox. The rabbits come over here to munch on some berries to hide from predators. And they probably just kind of run around this tree if they hear a noise and then, oh, bam! He comes over there and he gets caught. Then we got rabbit. We got rabbit fur to keep warm. We got rabbit meat to keep full. Rabbit sounds delicious. Okay, we got a, a small amount of daylight left, so let's let's take a little there's something moving up there. Maybe it's a deer, but it looked like a giraffe. Maybe it was just I don't know. Maybe it was my eyes playing tricks on me or the rendering. Yeah, I guess it was just the rendering. There's no giraffes here. There's no giraffes here. 
So let's try and get a headshot. A neck shot. So the cool thing is also when your spear sticks in them, you can track them. And we just ran all up on him. We want to get this buck. We've already wounded him. We can't just leave him out here running around with a spear in his neck. And it's in his neck. Oh, great. He's dodging. Oh, he's getting it. He's running with that spear in his neck, too. My guy. You can't run from me. Just give it up. Okay, let's try and hit him from here. I'm not good with distance yet. Oh, that's a mushroom. Where's my spear? No, we don't want to drink the water. Okay, so where'd it go? One. Okay, so there's one and one. Um. Okay. So he's running back towards camp. That is awesome. Oh, oh. Dang, I spooked him. Do we have another one? Did I hit another one? No, I didn't hit it. Okay, wait, 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 wait. We did lose one. Okay, it broke. Oh, he's getting away. Okay. Let's try from back here. Let's aim really high. Wow, that was really high. Okay, we have one more. Let's bring it down some. I think... I think we hit him, but... I don't have any more spears. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. Dang, he's got two in him. How many does it take? My guy. Got him. He is a machine. That was... That was a clean throw, too. Okay. Should we? Wait, that's crazy because I had three. I broke one, and now I have... Maybe I was one of mine from um, when I was out here earlier. They kept breaking. I had to keep making them, but I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so. Yeah, see, there's there's one here. Where? Maybe you just find spears on the ground. Um... Because we only had... Well, now I'm saying we have two, but we j literally... My axe and my hammer is gone. Like, they're breaking. Oh, okay. So we have three wooden spears that right there are at 66 condition. And then we have one that's at 33. Okay, so we have a total of four. Okay, so... Um, one... But what happened to our axe and our hammer? Um, we got one at one. So let's, okay, let's put, let's put that on two. Let's put another one on three. We got one on six. And then we'll put the stone knife on four. And then... We will craft a stone axe. We need to craft another hammer, but we need a log to do so. Okay, so let's go put our stone axe on five. And then we'll put our hammer on six. So we'll have one, two, and three will be spears. Okay, so five is my axe. We need a log. Let's get closer back to the camp. And we'll take down this tree right here. Uh, let's check the trap real quick. While we're here. Okay, nothing. Can't even jump over the trap, man. Come on, get it together. Okay. This is our last day until uh, winter time. So we're going to take down this tree. I'm going to pick up all these logs. 
and head back to the camp to cook some meat, put away our things, and make a hammer because we will be be building something again soon, very soon. We gotta start getting some villagers over here to help with the tasks so that I can do other things like complete missions for people. Okay, let's put I'm gonna put the wood and stuff in here. I want to make a campfire. And do some cooking. And while this is cooking, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here. i um, probably going to get back on later tonight and stream another one. Um, but I got some stuff I got to do today. So uh, thanks for joining. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you haven't yet, go check out RenGGaming.com. Um, not only does it support me, you can also get yourself some merch and, and look fly for the winter time that is fast approaching us here in real life. Um, if you are in the United States or this side of the world. Um, as always, I hope you guys have a great day and... Watch out for me for next time. Let's go ahead and save.